Alright everyone, in this video I'll be doing an unboxing of this crucial MX100 128GB solid state disc which I purchased from Amazon for £52. That's quite remarkable on price nowadays because I remember the second solid state disc I bought was an OCZ Vertex 4 256GB which cost me £250. That was almost £1 per gigabyte. Nowadays they're well, less than 50p a gigabyte that's quite a reduction. If you've never used a solid state disc before, it's difficult to really emphasise the improvements that you get. It's remarkable. Your PC or laptop will go so much faster. The seek time of a rotational hard drive is something like say, an average of 17 to about 20 milliseconds. So that's the time when you've asked to open the file to when it's actually opened. Now compare that to a solid state disk, it's 0.1 milliseconds. Now when your computer's opening up hundreds or thousands of files, that's just the average modern operating system now, it is yet yeah, thousands of files it has to open. You can see here it uh, adds up, those few milliseconds take seconds or minutes. Now that's quite ridiculous. Even just opening up programs, you'll find they've got to open up little config files or image files, and yeah. Using solid state disk, you get quite a speed boost. And for laptops, it's lighter, more energy efficient, and you can drop it, and it doesn't matter. I couldn't be doing that with a rotational hard drive, that would have broken it. But yeah, of course, the disadvantage is that they're still quite expensive compared to rotational hard drives. What we need to do is buy like a smaller, like 64 gig or 128 gig, and you can put your operating system on that. And you can put a, all your documents and videos, pictures, and that on the rotation hard drive. So there's ways and means of doing it. That's of course your options if you've got a desktop, you can put a couple of hard drives there. But for laptops, well, just get a reasonable enough solid state disk for what you need. Anyway, let's take a look at it. So looking at the outside of the box, well it's just a picture of it on the front there. On the back there we have the contents which is the drive and they provided a spacer. So 7mm to 9.5mm spacer. That is useful if your laptop requires the drive to be of a set size. Ok well let's open up and have a look. So it's wrapped in an anti-static bag. And here's the little spacer, just a piece of plastic, and I think these might be sticky. Are they sticky? Yes. So that's what, that would stick on top of the drive. The specs of it are 550 megabytes a second read speed. Now for 128 gig, it's slower on the write speed, so that's 150 megabits a second. 4K random read is 80K and 4 meg random write is 40k IOPS. So this is a bit different to the Samsung 840 Pro that I've used. It's actually got a metal base. The Samsung drive is pretty much all plastic and doesn't weigh anything. This seems to have a little bit of weight to it. So that was a look at this Crucial MX100 which I purchased from Amazon for £52. So thanks for watching, I'll see you all later.